welcome back to my channel. My name is Kelsey. I hope you're having a great day. I'm starting a series this week called Palette Week. Um, I've seen a few people do this. I think the first person I ever saw do this was Robin's Cup of Tea. And it's where you use the same palette for a different look every day of that week. So I'm going to be doing a different look with this Tartlet in Bloom palette every day this week. So this is day number one. I do not have anything on my eyes. I just have the rest of my makeup on ready to go. And I've kind of decided I'm going to start simple. So today, Monday, I'm going to start simple. And then by Friday, it's going to be the more like dramatic look. But so today is just going to be a super simple like day to day thing that I would normally wear on my eyes, like a normal look. And usually my eye looks are pretty simple, so we're gonna start off pretty simple. So if you wanna see the first day of Palette Week using the Tarte Tartlet in Bloom, just keep watching. All right, so day one using this palette, well, I've used it before, but for this week, um, like I said, I'm just gonna start with something super simple, something that I would normally wear just on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, the rest of my makeup today is kind of like rosy, and my hair is kind of rosy. And so I kind of just want to do like a monochromatic look today. So I'm probably going to be using, like I'm gonna do like two shadows today, I think. I think I'm gonna be using this Sweetheart shade down at the bottom and then something maybe up here or like funny girl to like highlight with. But other than that, like I'm just gonna do a simple wash all over the lid and just do something really simple. So I am going to just jump right in and start with just like a shading, like a, just a brush that you would use to lay down shadow. And I'm gonna go into that Sweetheart shade. It's kind of like a pretty neutrally pink. I don't know. And I'm just gonna put that all over my eyelid kind of a, well, it's got some color to it. I just got this palette last month for my birthday from my sisters and I have been totally loving it. My youngest sister, Lindsay, had recommended it. We were just doing some shopping when I was in California for my birthday present and it was like the first thing that she recommended. She's like, oh, you should get the tart Tartlet in Bloom palette. I love it. And I was like, I don't know. And I looked around for like half an hour trying to find something else. And then I was like, well, I really just want like a warm palette, like something that's neutral and like warm. And she was like, Kelsey, that's exactly what I showed you. So I'm just gonna be laying this color down all over the lid and then I'm gonna just kind of blend it out into the crease. I'm not sure if I'm gonna need more shadow yet or just blending. We'll see. Okay, I think that is sufficient for now. Now I'm just gonna take a big fluffy brush and just kind of blend out the edges. And I kind of want this to be like really smoked out, just like really diffused. So I think I'm gonna take a little bit more of the Sweetheart shade on this brush and just kind of work it into my crease a little bit and really blend it out. I've never done like a one shadow look using just a matte eyeshadow. Um, this was something that I had learned from Emily Noel do, using like a metallic shade of some kind and then just kind of maneuvering it around on your eyelid to make it look like it's multi-dimensional. Um, but so I'm trying new things today. But I really like this color so I've just wanted to see what it would look like. I've never done this look before but I think it looks good so far. I think that's good. I'm gonna take a smaller, like, more precise flat brush, uh, like shader brush, and I'm gonna just take that same Sweetheart shade and go underneath my lash line. 
And I'm just kind of wanting to smoke out the bottom lash line as well. I think I just did the easiest smoky eye known to man. And I'm just gonna intensify it a little bit. I'm gonna take a smaller blending brush and just blend that out a little bit. So I think I'm gonna take just that same brush and go into the shade Charmer. It's like this really light white color. Well, not white, it's like skin tone for me. Um, and I'm just going to highlight my brow bone as well as the inner corners. I'm trying to decide if I want to add something shimmery to this look. I usually highlight the brow bone with something shimmery. But I think I might stick with all matte today. Keep it a true two shadow eye look. That's it, it's pretty simple. Um, so this is the look I got. I'm gonna pop some eyeliner in my, actually, I don't know if I'm gonna do eyeliner. I think I might just do some mascara. I'm gonna pack some mascara on and I will be right back. Well, so this is the finished look that I got. I just popped some mascara on really quick and I really like it. I think it looks really good, it's super simple, a little smoky, a little rosy, but I really like it. So this was the first day of this palette series using this Tartlet in Bloom palette, which I've totally been loving. So if you want to see some other looks I come up with, make sure to come back tomorrow and check it out. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe down below if you haven't already, and uh, I guess until tomorrow, I'll see you later. Bye guys!